Hi everyone, it's Frugal here, and as always, I have my coffee because otherwise somebody might just get killed. So this is my update number three of my startup journal. And uh, what I had to do for this sprint that I planned out for myself was firstly, I need to do, needed to do Google integration. So that would mean that you can actually sign on with Google. The second thing that I had to do was access Google Drive. So my coder had to go and say, okay, hello, here's a file, there you go. And uh, actually I want to post it. Uh, there was a lot of complexity with this um, because there's a lot of, of infrastructure that I had to do on my side um, that included I had to then say, well, here for my previous, previous sprint, here's the customer, but the customer has files and folders that I needed to be able to create for them and also then say, uh, you know, create the uploads from that uh, and then also then take it and say, okay, I'm going to now go and, um, you know, take the file that I've uploaded, I'm going to post it. There, would, there was token issues, uh, the SDK is complicated, um, especially because of some of my business logic. Uh, you know, this, uh, for example, it's not necessarily uh, the Dropbox of the logged in person that would actually, I would need to access. It might actually be uh, the owner of the customer. So I'll show you guys that in a bit. Um, so if, if you're ready for the demo, let's go and jump in. Hi everyone, let's get into that demo now. So you'll see that I've got two different logins here. I've got one called Google for admins, and then I've also got on this side for the customer login. The idea would be for admins and business owners to uh, log in with their Google account so that I um, can write files to their Google Drive so that they've got all their files in one place. And then on this side, the customer can log in and they can upload the documents that they need to. So let's quickly log in uh, via the Google, um, the business owner site. You'll see that it's still in, in um, testing mode. So uh, we're just gonna have to um, say, well, it's not verified yet. So just say, yep, we're happy with that. And I'm gonna allow them because I'm gonna need access to their Google Drive. So um, down here, you'll see that we've got um, Discovery Life. We've got Medical Aid. As you saw last time as well, I can create another one. I'm creating, I can create it for Effectify. On the other hand as well, you'll see that I have customers and um, yeah, as always, and I can edit those customers. What I can do now is I can click on uh, one of the customers. I'm just gonna click on this one and you'll see that I've got a link to projects. So I have a discovery medical aid on here, but I also might want to add some more. So I can go here and say, well, I'm going to add life insurance as well because they need different documentation for that. And you can see there it has been added. So uh, then I want to go show you guys quickly. I'm going to log out. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you guys when I'm going to log in with the customer details, uh, how it's actually then going to upload and then send it to Dropbox. Sorry, I mean to Google Drive, obviously. So, okay, great. So let's log in here. So I'm going to go and I'm going to click the login button. Um, the dashboard is still a work in progress, but then you can see on the, on the left hand side here, I have medical aid and I also have life insurance. So for example, for my medical aid, if I click on it, you can see that I've already uploaded one document and it's given me a green tick to say, I have already uploaded uh, the um, ID document. I can now go as well and say, well, I have, for example, a proof of banking details and I can click on it. It's going to open up the file and I'm just going to grab the sad kapoo and I'm going to say, open it. There we go. It's going to now go and upload it. It's going to pop it in there. There we go. And it's successfully uploaded. And you can also see because it's only one document required, it's given me a green tick. So let's now go have a look in Google Drive just to prove that it is in there. Okay, so uh, we're in Google Drive at the moment. If you have a look here, we'll, you'll see that I've got a folder at the top here for, with my um, name and email address, which is the customer one. And inside of here, I've got Discovery Medical Aid and then Discovery Life Insurance. So um, if we click in those, and then you see there are sad kapoos over there and the ID document as well over here. So they are saving, which is uh, quite a lot more work than you would have imagined. Um, there's quite a bit of uh, things that needs to go into the background. Awesome. Okay, and that is it for this demo. Hi guys, I hope you enjoyed that demo. Uh, that was quite 
cool. I think that it's uh, looking really good. Uh, so for the coming week, the coming sprint, uh, I need to do some cleanup. Um, so for example, there, there's some issues with Google that um, though I have the right token, um, it can expire. And this is for security reasons that that happens. So what I now need to go and do is just build in some code that says, just refresh the token, uh, you know, if needs be, if it is expired, um, and some cleaning up on the UI, uh, just some cleaning up on some of the, um, you know, just, uh, messages coming back. Uh, I also need to just start now planning and saying, okay, well, once the document has been uploaded, which it has, when it comes back, I need to now keep track of what documents have been uploaded. And I also now need to say for these customers, I need to now go and say, well, you have uploaded all of these documents and you can submit it to say, I am all done. I'm going to start looking, researching only into um, email providers, which emails, uh, APIs I can log in, you know, hook into, that I can send from, uh, just so that I can get start, you know, can get started on uh, that as well. Um, and that's gonna be me for the week coming. Have a wonderful day, happy investing, and enjoy my startup.